What was his problem? I swear, sometimes this city gets uglier and uglier every step. Ah, uh, you'll get used to it. I'd really rather not. Ah, looks like we've got ourselves Hold on. quite the specimen. Huh? I knew I'd run into an unclassified sooner or later. Unclassified? Now, what data you're hiding. The fuck? Scientific name. What should that be? Hmm. Turncoat titillator should do it. <laughs> hey, what are you doing? Huh? Oh, sorry. I've been tracking a rare specimen around here, and I might have gotten a little carried away. You're what? Some kind of researcher? Yes, the name's Professor Morikasa, but most people call me the Sujiman Sensei. Sujiman Sensei? What is that exactly? <laughs> I catch your interest? How about you swing by my lab? I can explain more. So there's just like a mad scientist just kind of subdue that specimen. I'll make you some tea or snacks. Pokemon? Did it, it did say who's that hey, Suchman? Let's go. I don't know. Doesn't he seem a little sketchy to you? More than a little, my dude. This city if you bite the hand that feeds you. Besides, I take free over sketchy every day. Now let's get a move on. <sighs> Fine. Are the Pokemon sex perverts? The actual fuck? This place I call the Sujimon Center. It's a fully functional research lab. You mean your fully random office room? Anyway, you came here to learn about Sujimon, did you? Allow me to explain. Sujimon are... Monsters of men that make you super jittery, but super jittery men didn't have much of a ring to it. Super, Hence, super jittery men, Sujimon. I I did not notice that much of this, but I also haven't played a lot of Pokemon. Uh -huh. Okay, sure, it's a stretch, but all you need to know is that they're the definition of bad. Society needed a concept for men that give you the creeps and attack without warning, and that's a Sujiman. Then you're going around collecting their data. Why? I do it for the sake of world peace. World peace? Think about it. This planet teems with all manner of degenerates and criminals. Just take a look around you. Now tell me, how many bad guys are out there wandering around, and how are they classified? Can you give me an answer? Um, not when you put it that way. Indeed. When people ask themselves, what kind of bad guys are out there, how can I identify them? They're generally left to wonder. Do, do people often ask themselves that? Because that doesn't seem like a useful frame through which to view the world, my dude. And because they're left wondering, they go up to one of these bad guys out of sheer curiosity and often end up paying the ultimate price. Does that happen to anyone anywhere? What? That's why I'm recording who these monsters are and where they make their habitat. By doing so, I can lessen their impact on society by keeping people out of harm's way. I don't... That makes sense. Guess it takes a sketchy scientist to research sketchy people. But what made you decide to do this in the first place? Let's just say I had a rough past. The takeaway here is that I'm contributing to a peaceful world, and I take that very seriously. So, how much data have you collected so far? The thing is, every time I run into a bad guy, they always rush over to beat me down before I can gather data. You might say that's hampered progress. Yeah, I bet that would. <sighs> I'm at my limit here. If only I could find an honest, maybe even slightly reckless guy. Who wouldn't shy away I... from random enemy encounters or getting his hands dirty? Hmm. I... Hmm. Well, hope you find your guy. Let's roll, Namba. <laughs> hey, come on! 
Hear me out for a minute. What? Don't tell me you want us to collect a bunch of weirdo data. I don't... I know this is supposed to be light-hearted. But... Dehumanizing people based on aberrant behaviors and treating them like animals is not a good thing. And I don't feel good about playing a game that puts you in the role of somebody doing that. You hit the nail on the head, buddy. Now, I'm not asking you to go fight everyone you see. All I need is a little battle data whenever a battle does happen. Besides, I imagine two tough guys like yourself. And, and... Labeling people as bad guys... That's not a thing that ends well. You know? Elves get into brawls fairly regularly. I I realize I'm taking this too seriously and it's just a silly game, but that like actually bothers me. Yes. So, I was thinking, why not gather data while you're at it? Easier said than done. Perhaps, but a comfrey... Basically just an index of your enemy types that automatically updates when you encounter one? Okay, well, that's good. It's, you know... Like, a, J a JRPG should have a bestiary. It's just the way it's being presented in the game's fiction is uncomfortable. How's it going, Dark Snowman? Ah, uh, we're doing Pokemon. Says Sujimon Encyclopedia is what this world needs. How about I throw in some completion rewards? Oh, now I see those ears perk up. Hear that? A stewardage bun. Guess I do like completion rewards. <laughs> I guess I do like completion this rewards. Really does help society. I guess we all reap the benefits. Exactly. Glad you understand. Well, if it helps society to other people, um, then fuck it, I guess. <laughs> Let's hop to it, then. So, how do we go about recording your data, anyway? Ah, that's simple. This custom application I made does all the work. The Sujidex app was installed on Casca's smartphone. As for how it operates? Well, I think a live demonstration might best get you up to speed. Hey, time to earn your key. Who are these goons? Let's just say they're assistants who specialize in field work. Now, what's your favorite color? Red, blue, or green? Uh, not sure where you're going with this, but... I can basically ignore this whole thing after this? Okay. So, like, grass type? Water type, fire type? <laughs> Can I say white, fight the doc? Yeah, there we go. But doc, once you've studied all of the bad guys, the only bad guy left unstudied will be you. Oh, let's go let's green. Go with green. Okay then, green it is. All right, you two, give green here some backup. Now. Give them a taste of what I pay you for. Huh? Don't tell me you want us to fight. Yes, in fact, I do. Every time you wallop an enemy, the Suji Dex app kicks in. It records battle data automatically. That's freaking nuts. Gentlemen, I choose you! <sighs> Get ready for a Sujimon battle! Like, if they'd, if they'd made this guy, like, obsessed with martial arts, or, like, if it was the fighting he was interested in. Uh, imagine being referred to only as the color of the shirt you wear to work. Yeah, also that. Up. 
nice. See if we can take down the one with a bottle here. Oh, nice! Oh, sit down. Okay. Let's go. Oh, couldn't quite get him. Suspicious behavior. <laughs> Red, fight harder! My name is Tom. I'm supposed to be in accounts receivable. Yeah, I mean they do have names in the uh, <laughs> in the UI. The next game expands on this. <laughs> Sujidex, blue Sujimon, red Sujimon, and green Sujimon. Okay, so I'm guessing it really doesn't matter which of the colors you chose. It was just there as a Pokemon choose your starter reference. Ooh, learn the job skill Fearless Command. Impressive. Clearly, I chose the right people for the job. Keep that up and you'll be the best, like no one ever was. That's kind of you. <laughs> so where's the data at? Right. Why don't you tap that app and see for yourself? Category, substory, location... Skill burning bottle ignite. A Sujimon badgered by Sujimon Sensei into wearing a red suit. <laughs> Play animation. Alright. Wow. Two hundred and fifty two of these mofos. Alright. A week against lightning. The green one was weak against punchings. The red one's weak against water. All right. All right. Drops traffic wand and immaculate pain. Endorsing shout and sweet dreams. Freezing bottle switched on. That's the idea. Defeat lots of Sujimon, collect lots of data. And as promised, I'll reward you for the job. Expect to get some emails as you hit completion milestones. Hope it's not more trouble than it's worth. All right. Well, there's something in it for us, so we might as well give it a try. We're in no position to be picky. Yeah, you're right. Don't forget, the world's counting on you. So you gotta dispatch them all. Then you'll be the next Sujimon master. As <laughs> he looks directly into that camera. Jesus. Okay. Oh, interesting. Okay, so the X is always a uh, press rapidly, and the Y is always a timing game. Okay. I was not aware that's how it worked. Okay. If only I could be reborn as a sexy lady. You know what I'd do? I'd get a job at this club right here. Replaying Hades? Noise. I think I'm waiting on Hades 2. I played a bunch of Hades on the Switch. I started to play it again after I got my Steam Deck, and I'm like, you know, 
It's not a game where it feels good going back to zero. Hi, Mizuki-san. Their time is up. Okay. Go ahead and clean up the room, then count today's take. Front desk. The faucet's stuck? Well, just use the same bath water for the next customer. <laughs> yeah, I know it's dirty. Just use a bath bomb. They're behind the sink. Make it cloudy enough, who'll notice? <laughs> I mean, I think they'll notice that the water is cold. Jesus. Hello, this is Otohime Land. Oh, Nanaha-chan. Hmm. Oh, really? So you're taking the day off. But didn't you have your period two weeks ago? You're missing too much work. And if your excuses are true, you should get that checked out. I mean, it sounds like a serious medical issue. And if it keeps you out of work, how are you going to pay for your dear old dad's care, huh? Wow, like find upstanding citizen. Just died already. But I guess that's out of your control. Jesus Christ. Are you crying? Oh, come on. I only say these things because I'm your boss. I can't be your therapist too, but come back in as soon as you feel better. Okay? Bye. Jesus. I tell you, girls these days. So, you folks are here about the job we posted, I assume. Sorry. I don't think I want to be employed here. Ditto. Not a fan of anything I just heard. You out too, Kasuga? <sighs> so, you came all the way here just to insult me in my place of business? I'll have you know. Who's uh, that? pretty fucked. practically begged me to hire you three. They told me you'd be willing to do anything. I don't care what they told you. We've still got principles. Yeah, I'm grateful that Kanbei put in a good word, but uh, I pass. Plenty of other jobs out there. Let's go, Ichiban. Ichiban's about to hand this guy an ass kicking. Calling it right now. Ichiban, what's the hold up? Come on, let's go. You heard him on the phone, didn't you? Well, I've been to my share of back alley soap plans, but this guy's got to be the worst I've ever seen. The girls don't deserve that kind of treatment. <laughs> hey, there a problem? You better not cause any trouble here. I'll call the Yakuza. We're with the Seiryu clan, you know? The Seiryu clan? Seiryu, Seir me. Seir it together. And that's the way it should be. You really sure you want to start something? This is this Serio clan territory? <clears throat> well, this just got complicated. <sighs> hey, Kasuga, we need a scram. <laughs> <laughs> Why Come are you on. looking at me like that? I'll call them. I will. Uh, uh, <clears throat> I'll take the job. I'll start any time you want, boss. Huh? Wait, wait, what are you doing? Based on what I just heard, you got a lot of issues here, from plumbing to personnel. You need a hand, and I've got 16 years of direct experience in this industry. I know what works in these places, and I can even go scout some fresh talent for you. What do you say? Yeah, but what about those two? Prostitution's gotta go! No more Ichi Cho! What's that sound? A group of pests called Bleach Japan. Can't believe they're already back. The same guys as the other day. They've been demonstrating in front of my shop for a few days in a row now, like clockwork. It's a pain in the ass. Oh. They're specifically targeting you with these protests? Well... We're the last place in the area that's open about being a bathhouse. 
The others have all rebranded as men's salons or bubble massages. That makes it harder for Bleach Japan to build a case against them. So they come after us, since we're still open about being a soap land. They think if they can close me down, it'll start a shockwave and clean out the rest of the area. Fun fact, all those pictures of the girls on the walls are real adult video actresses. Yeah, I mean, it's they're obviously live-action pictures, so yeah, I sort of figured. Am I lucky or what? Listen. And the Yakuza won't protect yous? I tried complaining to the Seiryu clan once. They had some lame excuse, and then they showed up after everything had quieted down. Besides, Bleach Japan's ranks are filled with the types who read up on anti-Yakuza laws for the fun of it. Those kind of people are tough for even the real... Those kind of people are tough for even the Yakuza to deal with. That's the Yakuza for you. So if I can't go to the Yakuza, and I can't go to the police, who do I turn well, to? Well, damn. Even my employees are quitting to avoid being harassed. I'm at the end of my rope over here. Right. So that's why you're understaffed. But basically, you're saying as long as the girls stick around, you can still run your business. That said, between Bleach Japan and the way you treat them, I wouldn't count on them sticking around either. <laughs> <laughs> you don't get it at all. Girls who come here to work already have their backs against the wall. The girls who work here are all Japanese, but... They're in the same situations as an immigrant who came here to get away from whatever it may be. Losing a job like this might as well be deportation. They got no one to go back to or rely on. Okay. I always figured it was the money that brought girls to this kind of work. Yep. Of course, a lot of people who come get tempted to this side of things because it sounds lucrative. But those are the types who think they'll strike it rich without doing any real work. Soon as things take a turn for the worse, they run for the hills. That's why I only hire women so far out on the ledge, they can't afford to take another step back. Women like that work like their lives depend on it, and that's what keeps my business stable. Hey. What a piece of shit. Holy shit. Stable my ass. You're just taking advantage of women at their lowest. You're the scum of the earth. Say what you will, but lust weighs on the soul just as heavy as hunger, if not more so. Really? Except with lust, you can't just satiate it at your local deli. You have to hold it until you find an outlet. Jesus Christ. So as long as women are willing to be on the menu, men are going to place orders. That's the world we live in. What a piece of shit. Also, like... Really happy to be engaged to a woman who really likes sex. Uh, with me, specifically. It's a, it's a good place to be. I like it. I enjoy it. That, that's all. It's just... It's really good to be sleeping with somebody who likes sleeping with you. And, you know... Doesn't need to be coerced into it. It's a real nice position to be in. Yeah. Sup? Whatever. If we drive that guy off, will you hire us or not? Yo. Kasuga, after everything this slime ball just said, you still want to work here? I certainly don't. This guy's nothing like Hamako. The world would be better off if we let Bleach Japan take him down. Shut up, it's work, and I can't afford to turn that down. I'll take your job, and I'll get it done right. You gonna hire us or not? Fine. 